Today we're going to discuss a tool that is crucial for all business owners and all digital marketers, and it is MetaPixel Helper. So the Facebook Pixel Helper works in the background to look for conversions or Facebook pixels and provide real-time feedback on the implementation. Uh, with your Pixel, you're able to track individuals that are coming directly to your Facebook page and or you're able to track people that are clicking on your ads or your post as well. So let's go ahead and jump in and get started. So as with our other Chrome tools, simply enough, go to Google. And what you're going to do is you're going to type in Metal Pixel Helper. Once you do that, you want to download your Chrome extension and add it to the extensions toolbar. Once it has been added and once it's been updated, you simply enough, you can pin it to your taskbar or you can leave it where it's at. For me, I like to be able to pin all the extensions that I use frequently. And I'm going to go to a potential client of mine and check their website. So simply enough, if there's pixels that are on the website, you're going to see this little green number that comes down um, off the website. So here we can tell this one site, one website has two pixels. We're going to go to my website and we're going to go. And even though there's a two there, we can tell, see that we only have one pixel on my website. Let me refresh here. You have Facebook some fresh data and you can see that we have one pixel on my site. We're going to go to another client of mine and check their site. And you're going to see that they have a few more pixels on their site than the other two, just because this site has been shared by multiple individuals since it is a franchise. So there it is. These are all the pixels that are set up on the site and the pixel IDs are displayed for you to be able to copy and use for setting up uh, events or utilizing information for tracking inside of Google Analytics. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Please don't forget to like, share, or leave a comment below. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you can stay up to date on our latest tutorials. That's it for now. Have a great day.